Uh, good afternoon everyone, this is here. here. I've made a video yesterday, but it will take a while before I can post that actually, because it's a very long one. Well, some of you requested to make a video of this ship that I've created. It's very high clipper. I call the Crimson Speed Demon because it's my church ship on the previous server that I made and I miss the ship a lot and you guys asked to show me how fast it can go. But so far the Geo Navy says that I go around 24 knots in uh, South America. But the thing is, I don't always rely on the uh, Geo Navy because uh, it's not always accurate, especially if you don't make turns, it doesn't respond well enough so don't look at the for you always that can come out straight as you're on it and I must say so far this is super high clip it didn't disappoint me especially in terms of speed it is really not normal okay. <coughs> hot Oh, you yeah, all right, yes, that's fine. I've, uh, I'm equipping the windows here. Uh, I have all the Oxford speeds on. And I'm being toned. And also, my H ship has no Clement, so it, I won't have undergo any penalties on it. So, But uh, keep also in mind, uh, there's a campaign going on that every time five friends of your friends list is online, that get one person ex extra speed boost so there's a little deviation that you guys may see when you try it by yourself a few days later so keep in mind so far we are going to the Chelly Sea highest wave of the world But yeah, it's been a while that I've been recording this because uh, I was so busy with uh, investment and uh, it's been a while I, I was just on uh, with the Seven Nations run. I just defected back to Netherlands yesterday and as you can see, the Ottomans dislikes me on lat. Alright, let's get the right course on this so I can... I would try to keep the supply as low as possible as soon as we enter that uh, highest uh, speed sea area so we can see what the true maximum speed becomes uh, regarding it. Uh, <coughs> but yeah, I hope uh, you guys have so far grinding uh, good as well. But I must admit, it is a pretty tedious job that I that is what we are doing currently <laughs> after the reset so much things to catch up while the pets still keep going from Paparia and in my opinion they are going way too fast and even I can catch things up here at the moment <laughs> <coughs> uh, let's see it's gonna be a while But yeah, what I have hard side on is uh, two advanced splits, craftsman sails that I've bought and uh, deep sea beach plating and disaster proof. Some guns, I do miss a crest because uh, I didn't join the royal fleet yet, so yeah. <coughs> uh. The call didn't end here in the Netherlands, uh, but it will hopefully in a few days and I heard that North America suffers the same consequences. Well, at the bright side we don't need a fridge or a freezer, all our food we can put outside instead. Yeah. 
है How many friends are alive? One, two, three, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, yeah. Twelve, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nine, twenty. Thirty-seven. That is about seven percent speed bonus that I get now with my ship. So I need to keep that in mind. So keep it also in mind when you try by yourself once this campaign is over. It can a bit deviate from the ship that I be using now. But the speed that they have buffed, uh, that Kui and Papaya buffed so far, it's insane. All right, one of the showdown begins because now we are at the highest speed, so expect it will be go tremendous fast. Dropping the hold a little more. Yep, it's going well. And while this is happening, uh, Giovanni may not catch up how fast I go with the ship, because uh, even the game can't catch up. This happens when you sail at least 27 knots or faster uh, at some point. So, yeah. As you guys saw, the Geo of Navy spawned after I, I made a little turn. So that is, <coughs> that's mainly because that, uh, this uh, Geo of Navy isn't so accurate when I'm using it. <coughs> oh god. Whee! This looks a bit too funny actually, but... <laughs> I missed it actually. But this is not the only ship that can achieve this, there are several ships that they can do it as well, like the fitted long tuna, the wind jammers that I had been released recently. And also FS ships can also achieve it as well, like the cruise high clipper, long tuners. So there are many possibilities to achieve this uh, speed and uh, I'm sure you guys can do it as well. 27.5 knots. My hardest knot was in Celebrate High Clipper about 50.5 knots. Well, wait, 50.2 and 50.3 knots. Let's see if we can break this record, and uh, I'm uh, excited to uh, see it. We one. Two, one and two. <coughs> Almost there, guys. The British showdown is about to begin. I hope I can get to up the chief navy the egg accuracy of the speed grounds because it is a bit hard to determinate it. Oh, time to throw everything away. And make a little turn. Even turning this uh, Wowzers! Okay, the Giovanni is shaking a lot because uh, the game doesn't keep up anymore. <laughs> oh god. How much speed up do we have? Jeez. That's a lot. Oh yeah, I've not uh, to 
Blank 28 still handling, so this is supposed to be 208 bus station. 208 is. Well, I can tell this ship doesn't disappoint me at all. And all my more what I burned from this ship, it's worth it. But the sails can a little go higher still because uh, I don't use the best sails yet and uh, they may come out. And but I don't think it factorizes a lot uh, about it, but dang. Definitely is. I highly doubt if uh, any pirate of bounty hunter can catch this up unless there's a uh, superior Lamort. <laughs> I bet any pirates will laugh it and any bounty hunters the same. I will be looking forward to that ship as well. Uh, ship. Lamort and also superior Ah snap I <laughs> got some wind received I just forgot the uh, Aether uh, the windbreak won't work if you it's one person but if you don't have supply it won't work anymore but anyway guys I hope this video is uh, helpful to you and uh, that uh, that you guys uh, are determined to burst these kinds of particular ships because it's really awesome and I'm so happy that I've spent my money for it it's really worth it I recommend you to, to try to think about those ships as well and I will see you guys in the next video bye bye